It's kind of funny how we initially just went for like a RAM upgrade and now we're doing motherboard <laughs> replacement too. We didn't even find the tool. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we need to find the tool first. So for some basis, I'm currently at my dad's place, not my apartment. So I don't know where anything is, like where the tools are. Something crazy my dad has though is these routers. Freaking looks like a goddamn spider with all these ton of antennas. Literally eight antennas. It's a spider. And not just that one. Yes? Yes, can I help? You're not going outside. Because you, if you're not you're gonna run away, you're not going outside. Here's the second one. <laughs> TS2, why? <laughs> After I got me a drink. This will never get old, no matter what. Ah! <laughs> I'm busy. Final play. Uh. This is gonna look a whole lot different because I'm using my dad's phone, which is like what is a Note 20? Yeah. Your Note 20 Ultra. Whereas the phone that I'm currently using is a S8 Plus. So like S8, S20, or Note 20. Shoo. Shoo. I'm doing work. I'm gonna be doing work here. You need to move. I'm eating. You can eat anywhere. I need to do the work here. Still need to find a bloody screwdriver. <laughs> I showed I showed routers and I showed different phones, but I didn't find a screwdriver. You know, the thing I actually need. What? Oh, is that a screwdriver? Is that one I can use? <laughs> oh man. That's disappointing. Oh, is there screwdriver fits? Can I use any of these? I don't know. The answer is a resounding no, because none of them are Phillips. Someone explained to me how is it that even though this phone is like several years later than mine, either both phones are absolute garbage at focusing. That's like the reason why I want to fix that camera that I was telling you. That's why I want to fix the camera. Okay, dude, after your game is done, you're going to help me find a screwdriver. Because I can't find one. One, zero. The cottery. Congratulations, you won. Yay, first game. <laughs> Sweet. <laughs> like the other night. Yeah. That's not was horrible. Oh, yeah. Where did the cat run off to? Kitty. Kitty. What are you doing, Kitty? Hmm? What you doing? What are you up to? Hmm? Good Kitty. Finally found a screwdriver. Does it work? Yeah, it should work, hopefully. <laughs> but I mean, like, it's not a good sign when we had to search basically the whole house for like a screwdriver. That's at least not covered in rust. All right, let's get to moving the motherboard from this thing. Here, okay, let me let me pull it out. Ah! Oh my god! It's like it has like all this <laughs> dust. This is the current motherboard he's using. This one's a Asus Prime B450M motherboard. And we're replacing it with this thing. An X570. Oh my god. It's always difficult doing things one-handed. There we go. There's the whole motherboard. So much time. What is this? What? What is this? A sticker? Mm, obviously, don't need this. <laughs> so obviously now I gotta take all this stuff out too, because I'm gonna need to move it over to the new motherboard. Well, actually, we don't need to move these ones. These ones, I'm stealing. The reason being, because we're gonna be replacing those with these. G-Skill Trend Z Royals. These are like 
fancy AF over the top in terms of style that sensible people probably wouldn't buy, but we need sensibility when you can have silver RGB RAM with bloody crystals on it just to make it look cool AF. Look at that, you can like almost see me. You can see my hand. Pinky. That's very... <laughs> The light's just reflecting off it, like... The light just reflects off it so much. Yeah, I blinded myself. Uh, big ol' manual. Oh, here we are. Oh, fuck, I lost it! No, oh, here we are, good, I still have it. Okay, good, 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 good. This is very important stuff to know. You wanna make sure you put the RAM in the right slots. It's very important that you do it correctly because there's a certain order in how you should put them in depending on how many sticks you have. So we're going to be using these two specific slots. Line up and just apply pressure. Ah, so you get a click. Nice. Do it again. That. Oh. This is a very sharpest ram. <laughs> leaving marks on me. I'm not putting in this room without getting a few marks. And I gotta take this one out so I can take back the GPU and the CPU. And also because I need to plug all that stuff to that. You wanna help me? Sure. You can hold the phone. Okay, I got my sister to help me here. I'm gonna take out these three screws because these support the GPU. Oh, those are gonna be lost forever now. And then Push this out, and boom, GPU out, 1650, basic, but it'll get the job done. Oh my god. What? I think... Did you break it? No, this. I think... Did I never plug this in? There's one less fan running. Cool. I'm feeling something bad's gonna happen. Nah, nothing bad's gonna happen. It's perfectly fine. Okay, and then, oi, there we go. That just came out somewhat nicely. Okay, so now I'm gonna take these out. Oh my God, these are just caked with dust. Like, get closer. Like, you can see how much dust is on these things. Like on those screws. Whoa, look at this. Like the like the screws for the CPU yeah. thing, look how dusty that is. Yeah, like look look at them like yeah. on the screws. Yes, right. Oh my god, that <laughs> nice. That's actually very handy. Well, actually, it's a little scary. I'm a little concerned because this is, retention arm should have been coming out first, you know, for this to come out, but it just popped out. Like I don't know. The thing is, you don't want to accidentally break the pins. Well, yeah, no. no, this is very expensive. Yeah. I don't want to try and force it, but like... There we go. Came off. Nice. Uh, so gold triangle faces that thing there. The little corner. Wiggle. Got a bit of thermal paste on me, but that's fine. So turn arm down. And then I normally wouldn't recommend this of like just reusing the same thermal compound, but it's fine. It's fine. Well mainly it's just because we don't have any extra. Yeah. And that's all the way in. Finally. We got everything in. Yep. Michael, what? how do you feel that you just did it? I feel like I spent way too much time on it. That's fine. I need to take this part off because we only plugged in one of the front ports, right? Um, but now we can plug them all in so this motherboard supports it. Yeah, because... Yeah. Respect your elder. 
quiet. You're one to talk. You don't respect anybody. You're like terrible. You're the youngest out of all of us, and you're the most one of the most disrespectful. Sure. Yeah, but you're the youngest. Well, I found a tool with like 10 years that'll let me remove these standoffs. There we go. Yeah. Is there anything else? I bet you a lot of people, if they ever watches this janky video, they're probably gonna look at this and they're probably gonna be like, it's very difficult to build a computer. But realistically, it's not that hard, as long as you know what you're doing. Just do a bit of research and then you'll be good. Okay, so... I thought these, both of these would be down here, but only one is down here. The other one is right here. Kind of replacing it sideways like these SATA ports, so... I need to move this all the way to here, which means I need to... Take apart this back part again. Again. Yeah. yeah. This part is. Okay, so I just want to make kind of a note that. There might be a possibility that the reason why there are bent pins in the socket might be because I was going at it blindly, so I may have bent some pins in the process. So, yeah. Uh, right now, we are heading, or not heading, rushing back to the store and getting this thing replaced. Good thing we got a warranty for it. No! I was like, I was gonna like, got it! Almost made it. That's a shame. There's some quality audio. Come on, Red Light. You've been evil to me. Come on, give me a clean. You're being very evil. Oh, yeah, super evil lightning. <laughs> it's kind of funny, like with the camera, because this one makes your face a little brighter. Oh, so yes, that is my dad. Yo. <laughs> evil. There's a store! We, we need to get in there. There's nothing else we need, right? No. Okay. I don't know, but you know, you said about the tool. Next screw, so I'm the screw. Uh, you want me to go look for him? Yeah, go look for him. Okay, here. You can have that picture. You can record, right? No. So I'm over to my phone. My phone, not my dad's phone. Uh, here's a look for something real quick. Look for some tools. Right here. Uh, I'm going to show that these are magnetic. That's magnetic. Uh, so maybe this one will do. All right, I'll go check with him, see what he thinks. Uh, I hate to say this to you. Yeah. Uh, this is considered a physical damage. You can have the same one. <laughs> oh my goodness. Okay. Okay, whatever. Alright, let's see if I can do this. Uh, well, I'm actually moving them back. It can work, as long as I don't break a pin. But I got, I got most, I got like some of them back in place. So, I'm the truth time. Before I start screwing anything in. There we go. Ah, uh, fuck. I forgot I should just put this in right away. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna do it right now. There. That's in. Now I can go back to putting all the screws. That's, that, that's the main problem done now. Now.
And then shove it back in. Yeah. There we go. Now the only thing that's left to do is to try the front USB ports. Since after all, that was like the most fuck part. That works. That works. That works. That works. And then it works. Okay, there you go. Upgraded your PC, and that only took forever and a mishap. Crystal RAM. Nice. Now you have an upgraded computer. Yeah. Sweet. <laughs> and I get these things. Perfect. These are like faster than the ones I use, so perfect. All right. Well, that's the end of the video. This was a pain. So this is done. Oh man. Jump out like today!